Hey guys, what's up? And Best Ready here, and welcome back to another excited visual effect breakdown. This video will not be in step by step, just like I make other tutorials, but it will roughly guide you how I achieve this effect inside Blender and After Effect. So without any more delay, let's get started this video after NPS 3D intro. Alright, here we are inside After Effect, and first we have to track our clip. But before that, if you are a beginner, I have many tutorials available which will guide you step by step. So let let me show you how we will make this one. So first, we need a footage. Recently, I was traveling and I visited a location which is available in India called Dharmsala. So I shoot a clip, and this is our clip. So first, we have to track it just like we. To in all the visual effect shot, so I imported the clip inside After Effect, apply 3D camera tracker effect, and we will track our clip, and we will create a 3D camera solid and few nulls. After that, we will transfer this whole data like camera nulls and solid inside Blender using a add-on called A to Blend, which will help us to transfer data from After Effect to Blender very easily. After that, I need the 3D model, so I downloaded it from Sketchfab. I will put the download link in my video description, and you will also find all other links. After that, I imported that clip inside Blender and I placed the model where I want in 3D place. So for the lighting, I use Nishita Sky Texture. It will only work if you will use cycles. I change the lighting according to my real footage. For the Siva animation, I created a simple bone system and parented my 3D model with bone, and I manually animated it for the particle system. Like the flowers, leaves will follow a path and going to the Siva. I need a particle system and also a curve force field, which will help particles to guide where they wanna go. So first, I tested few example into a new project, and when I saw it will work, then I jumped back inside our original project. I created a particle system and also a curve which will guide the particles. I use Botonic to create flowers. Hours and leaves. I tweaked all the settings just like lighting, particles, cores, and many more things to make it my desired look. When I thought it looks right, then I simply render it separately. Like I render Siva model separately and also the particles separately so that I can, you know, it will help us to do composing a little bit more easy. After rendering complete, I open After Effect one more time imported all the sequences and I do all the crazy compositing and after everything this is the final result which you can see on the screen and guys this is just a short breakdown it took me around like two days and i render like three to four times to see and fix things so yeah this is it i hope you really enjoy this video if you learn anything please hit the like button subscribe our channel i will see you next time with an amazing tutorial keep working keep smiling i am in the city and i will see you next time bye bye